Fantastic. Fantastic. Thanks, Thanks for, for asking. asking. Excellent. They say that when you murder <laughs> someone, <laughs> the the everyone's just chatting it up. Nothing I'd like Welcome to back. They recruit so long. New members. Farewell. Is that so? They look so alike here. Someone saw the ghost of Lord Windwick. Look at that. They could be brothers. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk with Orin. Uh-huh. Take care. I feel I can truly be share with you. Huh? You're back. What have you found out about Galtus Pravia's disappearance? Dead? Damn. What got him? Uh found a shield near the corpse. Let me see that. Interesting. The symbols on it are familiar to me. I'll be looking into this. Oh, uh, what is it? Nothing we need to talk about now. I'll pay Varenus for his contract. This is for you. Who knows? I might be able to make soldiers out of you both. Play more of depletion. Nice. Uh, advancement? I'm sorry. Okay. I'm going to need you to find Maglir again. The little fetcher. Uh, defaulted again. Wish I knew what happened. He had a contract for a local mage in Bravia. Didn't seem like a particularly difficult assignment. He hasn't reported to the client at all. Get yourself down to Bravia and find Maglir. Make sure that contract of his gets done and send him to me. Ooh, you in trouble. Yeah. Stop I staring read one of Costa's Let's get to All right. Claymore Depletion. Absorbs magic at my four. And it's way too heavy for me. There you go. Just... Go. Like Gotta do my little words. my little trick I again. So I could get to a door and then it's like I can squeeze through it now. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> ah, damn it. Having an issue? Yes. Flying sword! Okay, now. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Gonna stab you without stabbing you! <laughs> oh, ah. Too much fun. Look out! It's coming for you! <laughs> There you go. Would you like a shave, sir? Would you like a shave? <laughs> but I stab you instead. And right in the butt. Right in the butt. Shaving that butt right there. There we go. All right. Now it's a clean shaven ass. Off we go. But your magic is depleted. Okay. Get to the door. There we go. Wee! <laughs> oh, jeez. We're having too much fun. Oh, of course. <laughs> Drop it again. And pick it up before it even drops. That's how magical I am. Pay no deed to the floating sword. As my hands are at the ground. And yet, of course, the sword just flies. Ooh. Okay. Hello. I don't mean to impose, but I'm hoping you can help me. My daughter, Dharma, is missing, and I don't know what to do. Uh-oh. Uh, Dharma. The best daughter a mother could ask for. Kind-hearted and a friend to everyone she needs. Hmm. Missing daughter. That's right. My daughter, Dharma, never came back from Hackdirt. I'm... Dreadfully worried something may have happened to her. Can you help? Yes, I can help. I can't thank you enough for your kindness. She was supposed to make a delivery to a Tira Moslin in Hector, so I would start there. In case it may be useful, she was with Blossom, her horse, I mean. Dama loves that animal and would never willingly abandon her. All right. 
Uh, let's see if you can barter a bit. Can I interest you in some of my wares? All right, I don't need the jade ring. A mercantile black outfit would work perfect for her. Silver necklace. You got a great deal there. Let's see, I don't need the wolf pelt, the ruby, or the silver nugget. Or any of the flawed items. You got a great deal there. Oh shoot, I can't sell my weapons to you. Oh, you can't? She doesn't take them? No, she doesn't. Find a blacksmith. Yep. I can give her these ogre teeth, though. I don't need them, and I can get some good. Thank you for your. You too. Steal it over encumbered. Um. Uh, oh Come with me, sword. Whoops. <laughs> Drop the sword. There we go. Off we go! Yeah, Stab in the back of the head. Whoops. There we go. Fire and steel. Okay. There we go. Mm. Well met. I offer the finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Good. I, I need to, uh, I need, uh, it's all the money I can get from you with this. 187 gold. It weighs so much and that's all I can get. Oh, well. Do you like me enough to up the price a little bit? 214. I'll take it. Let's see, what else? Dang it. A fine transaction. At least I can sell the arrows and get like a gold apiece. Well, that's good. Um. Yeah, nothing else. A pleasure. Yeah, good meeting you too. Bye. Bad well. Yeah, there's an iron long sword there. Excellent craftsmanship. Okay. So, I gotta go to Braville. Yes, you do. Braville, Braville. Just like with that other place that returned the deer mug. Yeah, yeah. Forgot again. I think that was back over at Anvil. Ah, uh, Braville's over there. Okay, excellent. Red Lodge. Yeah, I think it is Anvil. Uh, let's see. Where are spirits at? Uh, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, okay. Excellent. So, where are you going first? Back to Anvil. Last travel there, because I can't pick up anything because I have no room. <laughs> so there's no need for me to wander aimlessly if I can't gather the loot from the area. No, there's not. You're still over encumbered? Uh, yeah, this this armor that I decided to pick up, Rusev's. I wish I could just give it back to that one lady just like, here's all the armor and everything. I don't need it. Can't you sell it? I can, but I don't want to. It looks nice, but it's just like I'd rather give it to like the NPC. <laughs> it's late at night too. Let's go to my pleasant little manor. Oh shoot. New home to Fort Lee. Sorry. I, I keep forgetting. Doing way too many things at once. You are. Generous Inventus. Okay. There you go. Duheim to Fortley's house.
Hey, buddy. Wow, this is a real nice banister. Mm -hmm. And it's made of solid metal. That is sturdy as hell. <laughs> Wait, what? Traffic through Anvil Harbor comes mostly in exotic, high-profit goods. Easy to transport by road or Mage's Guild couriers to eastern markets. Nice. Uh, here's your heirloom. Ah, you've got it. Thank the gods. Finally, my mead will stay cold and won't taste like goblin piss. Take these <laughs> and my thanks. There you go. Take care. Newheim's special brew. Raise intelligence strains, will power, but restores fatigue, fortifies strength, and fortifies personality. Not bad. No. Not bad at all. I will enjoy those. And the pleasant music in the background. Alright. Time for me to stay in my new house. Dated, but you know, hey, a little love and care. I think this place could do okay. Arrived at my new house in Anvil, generous manner. Looks like the place needs some work, but it is a great, uh, great deal. I just couldn't pass up. I can now make myself at home. Ooh, some fortifying wines. Parchment and quill. All right. Everything definitely looks damaged. Some parchments. Lockpick, that's good. More quill and parchment. Mage's Guild Charter. Yeah. Alright, well. Time to call it a night. And the ghosts have arrived! They are frost resistant. Silver arrows! Yeah, it's fire! Ouch. Fire arrows for days! Yes, just don't come into this room! Okay, Dwarven Arrow time! Oh, that one hurt. Okay, that's one ghost down. Oh, they're very docile. Oh, never mind. Have you ever said that you had yourself a ranged battle with ghost in a with a bow and arrow? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Two ghosts down. Oop. 
Benner's Manor is haunted. I was awakened by a ghost that attacked me as I slept. As I awoke, I thought I heard a crash from downstairs. I should search the house and investigate. First. Here. Don't you still have to finish the last ghost? No, I got all three. Oh, you did get the third. Yep. Right there. There. Oh. And right here. Benner's Manor Ghost. Okay. You know, the weird thing is, though, these ghosts, they shoot ice power, or they shoot, like, ice balls or ice range. Okay. Yet, of course, when I take the ectoplasm, the ectoplasm has shock damage to it. Okay. Wouldn't you think they would be shooting, like, lightning bolts or something? Yeah, I would think that would make more sense. Or at least, you know, have, like, have, like, the ectoplasm do frost damage instead. Strap from Alorgrin's diary. I found a skeletal hand next to a page from a diary. The diary makes mention of a secret room in the house that only a true blooded Benners can open. I'm going to need to talk to Velwyn about this. I may have to ask around to find out where he's gone. Two Suns, Dawn, 3E335. The people of Anvil are worms. How dare they criticize what they don't understand. I shall have my vengeance in a form they cannot possibly imagine. I shall use the souls of the departed to prolong my own life. Its home is very specific. I must have more bodies, yes, more bodies. Mm. Eleven Suns, Dawn, 3E335. I must protect myself from those meddlers. They shall not interfere in my designs. I've constructed a room in the basement of this manor. It is there. I will enter in my, per my corporeal self, and I will transcend this plane of existence. Only a true blooded Benares may open the portal, so if I fail, however unlikely that may be, a descendant may attempt to follow in my footsteps to carry on the true way. To make sure our secret is safe, I have harnessed the spirits of those whose bodies I have defiled to forever guard that place. Fifteen Sun, Dawn 3E335. The fools think I don't hear them speaking. I can hear their rumors and innuendo. They intend to meddle in powers they can barely comprehend. They call me an old fool and shun me. The young dare each other to step one foot in my yard. I have become the stuff of old wives' tales and campfire stories. They dismiss me as an oddity, but soon they will see. When all of Ember lies in waste around me, when their corpses live in the street and their blood dampens the earth, only then will my true power be known and feared. Okay. Ooh. Well, shit. You took the hand? I, yeah, of course you gotta take the hand. Oh. Come here, ghost. I see you haunting around there. Oh, that was a close one. My arrows are just flying all over the place too after they hit them. You see that? As soon as they hit the walls, like they go through them, whatever fire magic is like, ding, damage, and then they just bounce off the wall. That's awesome. Alright. I need more fire damage. Come on! Fight me! There you go. Now I can pick up all my arrows now that are littering the ground. Ectoplasm. Ooh, more ghost! Whoop, I missed. Whoop, that was close. Fly, true little arrows, fly. Right in the face. Well, ghost face. Pick up all the arrows that I flew all over the place. Where are the other, where are the other arrows? Oh well. Okay. Well. This was wonderful. I'm going to escape now. Run right away! Yeah. 
that, so that's Venerous Manor. I'm gonna need a few other items, something that can do fire damage. What's your armor encumbered? I I can carry nine weight. Nine weight. All I got is a bow that can do fire damage. I'm gonna possibly need to find other things that can do fire damage. Oh yeah. So, I'm gonna stop it right there and just say hey, thanks for watching. Have a good one guys! <laughs>